outside. A Norton Shores woman is recovering tonight after she was attacked by a dog she brought into her home. 13 on your side's Lauren Baker has details. An act meant to help out an animal. I think he meant to do well. Uh, unfortunately, in this case, it just it didn't uh, didn't end well at all for the for the homeowner. Turns into the catalyst for a tragic situation. On Monday, a Norton Shores woman was attacked by a dog at her home. Norton Shores Fire Chief Bob Gannon says it happened after the victim's son brought the dog, which is a Rottweiler, home. The son um, noticed in front of the, his place of employment that there was a dog chained uh, to a fence or chained to a, a telephone pole. And the son, you know, um, wanted to do good and brought the dog in. Um, unfortunately, that dog was the aggressor of the two dogs um, and um, created this incident to happen. It's unclear how the attack started, but what is known is that the dog dragged the woman out of her home and continued its attack in her front lawn. The attack was so severe that she received injuries on both of her arms. The extent of the injuries were pretty severe. Um, at this point, um, so severe to where we probably uh, unsure whether or not they're going to likely be able to save the arm. But even as bad as the attack was, the chief says it could have been much worse. The only way that this incident was brought about is because the uh, a passerby saw the woman um, laying in the front yard um, face down being attacked by a dog. So this, this could have ended much, much worse. Um, thankfully, uh, a passerby, a neighbor, noticed it and called 911 immediately. Lauren, you mentioned another dog. Did that dog also attack the woman? No, Julia. Officials believe that dog was already owned by the woman and did not attack her. Only the other dog did. Right now, both dogs are in custody at Pound Buddies. It's unclear if anyone will be charged in the case. The chief wants to remind people that even if you see a dog or animal and they seem to be nice, if you don't know the history of their aggression, it's best to be cautious about taking them into your home. In the newsroom, Lauren Baker, 13, on your side.